And we're back. You're listening to the Talking Boxing with Billy C Show. You're watching a replay on LDL TV. Glad you could join us. Speaking of LDL TV, did you ever hear of Sal Sinicola? Did you, did you ever hear of the fighter Sal Sinicola? Uh, you probably haven't because he hasn't been in the ring uh, in a long time. But let, let, let me give you a quick story. Let me give you a quick story. Sal Sinicola uh, was a very successful amateur fighter in the early 1980s. Uh, he had he compiled a record of uh, 102 wins with only six losses. This is a United States guy, by the way. Uh, I know he sounds Italian, but uh, he's from, uh, he was born in New Jersey. Uh, anyway, uh, 102 and six. He turned pro in 1982 and uh, rattled off, uh, uh, rattled off uh, uh, 16 wins in a row. Uh, actually, uh, I'm sorry, he rattled off uh, 18 wins in a row, and uh, 11 of them coming by knockout. Um, he had a, uh, a rough fight in uh, 1987 against uh, Brian Padden, uh, where he lost a very close, uh, controversial uh, decision, which set him up for a fight uh, against Louis Lamelli, who uh, uh, was going to give uh, the winner of that fight was going to get a shot at a, at a world title, and uh, and Sal uh, uh, fell short. He had an injury and everything else. Um, that was in 1989. All right. Um, if I told you that uh, this guy Sal who's actually two years older than me, uh, was making a comeback. Would you believe me? Well, it's the truth, man. And uh, not only is uh, uh, it happening, it's going to be happening right on LDL TV. Um, the fight is scheduled in March, and uh, you got to check it out. Go, go up to our website, www.billycboxing.com, and right on the front page, right on the, the front page, right to the right, on the top, uh, is a fight poster. It'll take you right to uh, where you can buy tickets. You can also get some additional information. It's uh, called the uh, uh, Return to Reality Tour. Uh, that's the uh, name of the show. We're going to be doing the broadcast. I'm going to be doing the uh, uh, the uh, commentating along with uh, my man, former uh, uh, world champion, uh, Nate Campbell, who's going to be uh, fighting next week. So uh, check it out. We're going to be talking a lot about it. We're going to have Sal on the show. Uh, this is a, a, a rocky story. Oh. Oh, did I forget to mention that his nickname was Rocky? That's right. And and do you know who gave him the nickname? Uh, no, nah, not Sylvester Stallone, although Sylvester Stallone was his manager. <laughs> you know, but who uh, who gave him the name? Who said, I want you to use this name, Rocky, was the other Rocky, the Rocky Graziano. Now, Rocky Marciano is a guy that everybody remembers. There was a lot of Rockies. Uh, but Rocky Graziano, uh, personally, uh, told Sal Sonicola to uh, that he was, was allowed to pick up the the Rocky torch and uh, and run with it, and therefore from that day forward he took on uh, the nickname Rocky. So uh, this is a true uh, Rocky story. Underdog guy uh, uh, in his fifties uh, going to be making a comeback. He's already licensed. Uh, he's already been in training. The guy looks fantastic. Uh, we got a, an interview. We're going to send you. Uh, uh, we're going to send out some links to. Uh, where well, you can check that out. We're going to do an interview with him. I'm going to be out there for uh, for the whole thing, the way in and everything else. So we'll keep you posted on that. It's going to be coming up in about a month. Uh, so uh, check it out. And if you're in the Florida area, it's going to be in uh, North Florida. Uh, definitely check it out and buy yourself some tickets now because this fight will sell out. Uh, apparently, there's uh, a lot of uh, uh, there's a lot of. Uh, uh, local people that just absolutely love Sal, and they, they're, they're all fighting for tickets right now. So I strongly suggest that you uh, uh, get yourself some tickets in your, if you're in the Florida area. If not, uh, mark it down on the calendar and, uh, and check it out uh, right here on LDL TV. So, um, we're reading some emails, and we're getting ready for uh, Scotty to come. 